Hey Notion nerds, Tasia like Fantasia here with a Notion quick tip for you. So when I'm building out my Notion workspaces, one of my favorite design features that I like to use are these full width banners or dividers. And a weird quirk about Notion is that the banners won't snap into place if you're trying to do this on the desktop app. So the only way to do this is using the web app. I've never tried it on mobile, so I don't know if it'll work on a, f I don't, I don't think it'll work on a phone. I'm not sure if it'll work on an iPad. I haven't tried it, but this is the tried and true way that I'm able to get these full width borders to show up in my Notion workspace. So usually if you want to do a full width banner like this one, the, one of the things that I love to do most often with Notion is I just drag and drop whatever I want in here. And for that gradient banner, all it is is just this gradient image that I have saved. So you see that it pops up and it's loading. We're gonna let it load. But while it's loading, don't forget to like and subscribe so you can stay tuned for more Notion Quick Tips in the future. I'm going to try to release a new Notion Quick Tip every Tuesday. So keep an eye out for those. All right, now that our image has loaded, let's go ahead and when you're trying to do the full width, you want to snap it all the way to the side. But you'll see it won't snap. It just kind of gets a little spazzy on you. <laughs> so if you pop into the web app version of this same page, scroll down. Here is my same image that I want to turn into a full width banner or divider. And you can pull it all the way to the side and you see that it snapped to full width. Now, all you have to do is resize to the width you would like it. And this is something where I also will often put text in the full width banner and use it as a header or for a section in my page. A really great example of that is my creative flow template. And sometimes Notion, even on the web app, takes a minute to update this full width banner. So if you hit refresh or on a Mac, it's command R. I think on uh, Windows, it might be control R, but that should refresh your page. And it should, fingers crossed, <laughs> show the resized banner width, or I guess height. Width is wide, height is tall. I know that. Okay, so now that my page finished loading, you can see here's that full width banner resized to a smaller height. And if we want to check out some, what this would look like in a real life view, or for the headings, sorry. <laughs> if we wanna see what this would look like with text headings as well, I'm gonna take a quick peek inside my five steps for creative flow template. This is available for free through my Gumroad account. So if you take a peek at this and you like what you see, you can head on over to Gumroad and check it out. I'll have that linked in the description below for you. So when you're doing the full width banner and you're using it for text, this is how it will show up. So one thing you need to be mindful of is you can't minimize it to the smallest amount. Otherwise it'll cut off the text that shows the text that's visible. And depending on how you want to create the banner, if you want it centered, you have to make sure that the text is centered both vertically and horizontally. But if you want it to align closer to like 
the left alignment if you set your page to full width and you want the headers to be closer to the left alignment then you'll need to set up your banner heading so that the text is further over to the left um, and that's where I usually use the left justified text option but what I can do is I will also link in the description a canva template for creating your own headers like this that way you at least have a starting point for the text size and ideal image size to turn image into a full width banner in notion so I hope you enjoyed this quick tip and again stay tuned for more quick tips coming up every Tuesday and every Sunday I will be going live to talk about my most recent build with me notion projects all right friends Thank you so much for joining me today. Don't forget to like and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos coming up. And let me know how your full width banners turn out in your Notion workspace. All right. Thanks, friends. Bye-bye.